you. Why does it take so long? I'm in New York. I don't know New York's processes, but I know here, so in Norfolk County right now is incredibly backed up. And unfortunately, the pandemic has made the court system even worse, where I think a lot of lawyers were hoping that once things started going virtually, that they'd be able to utilize the virtual system in order to make the process better. Haven't seen that actually working out. And I understand it's probably difficult. You know, I, I'd love to say, oh, I'd do it, you know, so much better, but there's so much that goes into it. However, in Norfolk County here, you know, it used to be that you could get a motion for temporary orders, which is basically asking the court during the pendency of the case to put something into play so that both parents are on the same page with who has what rights and responsibilities. And you used to be able to get into court within, you know, six weeks at the latest. And now we're seeing, you know, especially in Norfolk court, our motion for temporary orders aren't being set down for months. And we literally have to go into court on motions for short orders, asking for it to be heard sooner than in the regular course of time because there's an issue that can't wait that long. And it's a big problem because there's things that oftentimes, you know, if we could just get them resolved quickly, it would help decrease conflict later on. I'm not sure why it takes so long. I know there's a lot of things that can also go into it. You know, sometimes it's just the other side that's dragging their feet. Sometimes there's discovery that needs to be done. There needs to be questions to make sure that you're entering into an agreement, fully understanding the situation and what you're giving up. It's frustrating. And I can say that even being on my side.